Yeah, 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 yeah. YouTube family. What is going on with y'all? We are back once again, man, with another video, man. Today, your boy has a shoe to show y'all. Who is calling me? Nobody important. But yes, we do have a shoe today that I think is a dope piece. I'm um, a collector's item in my opinion, man. This shoe, I will not be rocking, man. This is one of those few shoes that I'ma just like throw to the side and just, you know, have as a collector's piece, man. It comes from a very iconic person. And um, that person is none other than Anthony Penny Hardaway. You know what I'm saying? Hey, he is goaded. You know what I'm saying? If you know about him from the early 90s, you know about him. He has been going crazy lately. lately. A lot of his past shoes from like, you know what I'm saying, the early 90s have been retro and I think uh, we, not even think, I do know we are having a release of the Air Max Penny 1. Um, I think it's August 10th is the official release date. And I think the white colorway, the uh, home colorway, I think we're also getting that pair too. So he's retro on a lot of these shoes, man. So the shoe that I do have is from the Penny One family, but it is a collaborated shoe from the social status, man. So without further ado, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna show y'all those shoes. Before we get into it, make sure y'all hit that like button and subscribe if this is y'all first time rocking out with your boy Jay, man. Um, but yeah, man, other than that, let's rock out. Let me show you what these shoes looking like and um, give y'all my thoughts on them and let y'all know why I feel that this shoe is a collector's item, man. So let's get into it. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Bang! So here we go, man. Taking a look at the box, bro. Um, I guess I can hold it up this way. Actually, you can hold it up both ways. They got right and going like up and down, and it also has right and going like this way. So you can kind of hold it either way. But um, it says on the box the what does the the quick the quick brown for jumped over the. This <laughs> trying to cook a sandwich. Jumped over the lazy dog Nike. Sound Nike social. I'm tripping. Nike social status. Nike social status. The quick brand. It says it over and over. So yes, that's what it says right here on this bottom half. It goes from one sentence to the next sentence. Those two sentences that I just read off. If y'all understood what I was saying. But it does have like a chalkboard like thing. You know what I'm saying? It has cursive written on the chalkboard. So something different. And um, I definitely um am a big fan of collaborated shoes. Um, because they always do something different than the norm. So for that, I always love collaborations. You know what I'm saying? It does have the Nike swoosh and the social status sign right there. Um, I don't know if y'all can see it. It's kind of glossy. I don't know if it's picking up, but it's right there in the middle. That Nike and social status sign. But um, opening up the box, man. Um, it has a lot number on the box. I can see like the welt of that social status sign from the inside so if y'all want to get a legit check quick or something going on I don't know if the fake pairs might have that but anyways you got more of this like a school thing you know what I'm saying because you do have paper so you got like a paper right there on the shoe paper and it has your social status symbolization so you do got the social status symbol as well as that shoe paper style you know what I'm saying look on the shoe paper when you pull that back, you get plain paper now. So we're getting closer. And when you open up that plain paper, we got the shoe, man. So bang. Here they go, man. The Nike Air Max Penny One. Social status, man. Let me pop them out and um give y'all my honest thoughts and opinions on them. First thoughts, you know what I'm saying? It comes with a lot of extra things. I don't know if y'all seen it from the glance that I just showed y'all, but right over here to the side, it's like, dang, whoa. Look at this. Boy, if this shoe ain't made, that's why your boy got to keep this as a collector's piece right here. Because if this shoe ain't for your boy, Jay, do you not see one, two, three, four, five, six pairs of extra laces, including the black laces that come inside the shoe, bro? Like, this is just, bro, this is crazy. I think this is like the most spare pair of laces that have came with the shoe in a while. I ain't going to say ever, but in a while, man. Let me set these back here. A buttload of laces. Um, checking out the shoe. Definitely a clean shoe, bro. Definitely a clean shoe. We gonna check those out further in detail. But um, grabbing the other shoe. Yes, sir. Set that right there for a second. Let me um 
close this up, put it right here behind me for presentation. Y'all probably ain't gonna be able to see it because I'm covering it. But anyways, yes, man. Nike Penny One Social Status. Bang. So here they go, man. Right here, definitely, definitely um resembles the OG Nike Penny One. I can tell slight subtle differences, starting with the outsole of the shoe. Of course, you would have an all white upper on the OGs, but it's like a translucent hit, and it does have like some writing. What does that say on the inside? Um. I can't, I, I, I can't make out with it. Is, is it a basketball? It might be, I don't know. I'm, I'm not going to mis, mislead y'all and tell y'all the wrong thing, but that is how it looks. You got your big, um, gigantic swoosh right there. You do have the same style of the bottom with the air bubble and um, the uppers, slight differences as you can see. Um, you do not have this baseball theme on the original shoe and that right there where that swoosh is, is interchangeable man so you do have interchangeable swooshes it comes with how many swooshes is there here? like one two three four different colors so you got four different color swooshes that come with this shoe man so a lot of accessories bro this shoe comes with a ton of different accessories this is one of the two different colorways in the social status release um this also did release alongside the white pair which I thought was dope in my opinion, man. Shout out to the homie H-Town Hype Beast, man. If y'all don't know who that is, he is on Instagram. Make sure you give him a follow because he be posting like dope on feet pics of his shoes. And he posted a pair of the white ones, man. Right there, bro. I had to, bro. I, I, I don't even know how many fire emojis I had sent them, man. But with those neon vote laces and the way he did the double swoosh type, you know what I'm saying? fire man he did that right so definitely was a dope dope picture and a dope look i mean just look at it bruh fire fire man um social status ended up reposting that picture because like i said bro it was just fire the way he put that together man but i think you can do something similar with these i have not seen this pair on feet yet i haven't seen nobody doing um any uh you know interchangeable nike swooches or you know uh the the, the patches the Laces, I have not seen nobody do that yet. So I'm waiting to see a good pick of them. And who knows, man? I might end up going against my word and throwing them on feet. But for now, man, I think I'm gonna just ice these. I do have the original penny ones, which is the 2022 release, and I do have a video coming for that soon. So that's gonna be similar to the look of these. However, it won't have the whole bunch of lace swaps that this one would have. But something else different, man. It does have a lace lock, man. So your OGs does not have that lace lock. Um, that penny logo right there on the tongue. I think the OGs do have that, but uh, social status sign on the back right there. So definitely a clean shoe, and this is all over suede, man. All over like a is a yeah, all over suede, and is it like a two tone? Yeah, man, it has it has like a two tone motion on it, man. I don't know if y'all would be able to see it, but it does have like a a back and forth type motion on it, man. Very very light, but it looks like the suede. Oh my gosh. It's like, whew, this feels like a pillow right here, man. The tongue is so, it's so soft, bro. Like, feel like feathers in there or something, man. But definitely a very soft tongue. So I know this is going to feel good around the, your, your upper, your forefront of your foot. So I think that's going to be comfortable, man. But taking a look at them right there up close, definitely not a bad pair of panties. Like I said, they very much so resemble the originals. Those patches, like I did say, they can come off. Um, you do got that regular, like this right here looks like an OG penny, minus the blue outsole. If this was white, it would look exactly just like the uh, the OG pennies. Minus two, this is another thing too, because on the original pennies, you got that checkered, that white and black checkered look right here, and it's all blacked out on the social status version, but definitely real close, and um, I do like the touches that they put on it, and another reason, like I did tell y'all, why I'll be icing these out, I don't think I need, like, it won't make no sense for me to wear this shoe. This is more of a special shoe as far as because it's a collaboration, it's something different. Um, I think that this would be more of a, a 
you know, a valuable shoe. Of course, we gotta respect the OGs, but like I said, man, a collaboration, we might not ever see this shoe retro again. We will probably more than likely get the Penny One retro in 10, 15, 20 years, you know what I'm saying? But a social status Penny One is less likely to be retro than the OGs, so I'ma just ice this one, and I'll go ahead and rock my uh, Penny Ones, man. That's just my thoughts, man. But what are y'all thoughts on these joints, man? How y'all feeling about them? I do have a lot of upcoming um, reviews and on feet, man. Mark my words, I think I'm gonna drop one tomorrow. Uh, look forward to an on feet tomorrow and the day after that. I will, I will, I will definitely have an early on feet review of the Desert Elephant 3s. So stay tuned for that as well, man. Make sure y'all give this video a like so your boy can rush them out to y'all. Like I said, man, look, y'all motivate your boy to keep going. So the more feedback I get from y'all, the more we gonna keep elevating on this channel, man. But hey, that is it for the social status X Nike Penny Ones. Let me know once again what are your thoughts on this shoe? Um, do these even compete? Like, do they compete with the OGs? Like, as far as would you say that one looks better than the other? Like, I know we all probably standing on the OGs, is why I'm saying it. I'm like, everybody's more leaning towards the OGs, but do some of y'all think that this shoe looks better than the OGs? Y'all let me know down below in the comment section. But other than that, man, social status. Penny ones, the black pair that is, they are in the collection. And like I said, man, do not look forward to on feet from your boy. I'ma keep it real because these, they just going up, going up on display. I might throw them in a case or something. But yeah, man, definitely glad I got them. I think I'ma go after the white pair. I'm not 100 percent sure right now. But we'll just see, man. Y'all stay tuned. Your boy Jay making movies. And um, yeah. Till the next time, man. Woo. I'ma catch y'all, bro. It's a dope out, so Lenny. I'm gone, man. Peace. Oh, no. We the ones originated, so you better show up with that payment. What was pure, they suckers tainted. That's the picture that they painted, but they fake. They you ain't just take the stick and no food gates. Swap out the lace and my flu games. Mr. Swap it out, he got two names. Yeah, yeah. Just a little info for your can folk, just in case it didn't know it. Made a couple bandos for my handles, better ball don't blow it.